Hi, this is Wayne from Goldtone, and today we're going to be talking about truss rod adjustments. This is the double adjusting truss rod that we use in all our Goldtone instruments. The truss rod, if you were to take off the fingerboard, is under the fingerboard and embedded inside the neck. Now, first off, if you were to play a perfectly adjusted fretted instrument and you were to look down the neck, you would find out that the neck is not straight. It has a little bit of relief or bow in the neck in this direction here. The reason why that is, is for the string to clear the next fret without buzzing, that relief will help in expanding the distance between the underside of the string and the fret. So, the method that we use at Gold Tone to adjust the truss rods is we put a capo on the first fret, and then we hold the string down at the last fret. <clears throat> we use a feeler gauge, and the feeler gauge goes on the top side of the fret, on the end of the side of the string, and we take a measurement. That measurement should be, be between 0.006 and 0.008. If we need to adjust the truss rod, we use a T-handle a wrench. We've taken the cover off, and the truss rod socket is inside that cavity. As I turn to the left, it increases the relief and as I turn to the right, it straightens the neck. So you can look down the neck and actually see the neck doing its curve. And that right there looks pretty good. So I'm gonna give it its final test. Going down the last fret, measure it goes on top of the fret beneath the string, and that is about perfect. So that's the method of adjusting your truss rod on any gold tone instrument.